Hey everybody, it's Dean Etheridge, and I wanted to address a, a common topic that I run into all the time when, when I tell people that video marketing is the best way for them to get leads and they can get leads right away. I'm dead serious, and it's, you know, if you're looking to get into blogging and building a presence online, you know, of course it all starts with a blog or a way that you can send people back, but when it comes to video marketing, I just don't think there's a better way out there to get business right away because as you're watching this video, you're, you start to identify with me as a person and that's what people really want to do. When they want to do business with a small company or they're looking for a network marketing opportunity or something like that, they want to work with somebody that they like, know, and, and feel like they can trust them. So you get to see a little bit of the personality, but some of the common questions that I get are the, the, the biggest fears. And fear is just an acronym for false evidence appearing real. And with that, you know, there's nothing to be afraid of. You know, people talk about they don't have a good camera, they don't have a studio, they don't have lighting, they don't have a whiteboard. And I want to show you a simple way that you can get a nice backdrop today. And if you don't have a camera, I'm shooting this video on a cell phone that, you know, so many times now the cell phones have, that's an 8 megapixel camera, it shoots in high def. So if you have a pretty decent cell phone, an iPhone, it's just leaning up on a ladder. It's kind of funny. This, to uh, look back there and, and look at the cell phone. But I want to show you what I did in the back of my office here uh, to create a whiteboard, a big six foot by seven foot whiteboard. Instead of spending a lot of money on it, uh, you know, for doing some, some educational videos and that kind of thing, I used a product called Rust-Oleum. And I want to show you what I did is I just, I went, got a level, leveled this off here uh, and just taped it off with this frog tape, okay? And, you know, it's just green tape and you can get the blue tape from Lowe's, but when you go to, you want to get the Rust-Oleum from Home Depot. It's only $20 for a quart, and a quart with three coats will do about seven feet. And you want to make sure when you tape it off at the bottom that you've got, uh, you know, some protection because it will leak. It's, it's really thin and it takes three coats to put this on, but when you're taping it off, I'm going to take this off now, but when you're taking this back off, you want to make sure that you're peeling away from the wet paint. As you can see, I've laid this out, and I'm going to take my time. I'm going to skip through this and get to the end result, but you get the idea. Just take your, I got a four foot level, if you got a two foot level you can do that, but you just want to mark off your wall, any wall in the house, and you want to put primer on the wall to where this whiteboard paint will stick, uh, because it won't just stick on a regular wall, trust me on that. It needs some kind of adhesive, and primer acts as an adhesive, so if you have a, a tan wall, you know, you can shoot uh, videos. Uh, I've got a storefront out in the front that I can shoot videos there, but in the back, very simple, and I can write here. Uh, if I want to sit here on my stool, I can put captions out here on this white board, or I've got a purple wall right over here. I've got a black wall in the back, so just depending on what my mood is or what I'm trying to convey, I can make a, a backdrop anywhere in my house that looks like a professional studio. Now, again, we're shooting this with a, just a cell phone, a nice high-def camera, so it's not the best quality. We don't have studio lighting in here, but don't get so caught up in being too slick because sometimes people, uh, people will do what you do, and if you're too slick with your presentation, they may not feel as comfortable calling you. So be yourself, uh, have fun, get, get excited before you shoot your video. What I would do is I would, if I were to start out today and want to get involved in video marketing. I would go out and I would get a camera, if you can afford it, if it's in the budget. Uh, Kodak zi 8 is an older model. I think there's a, a place for it now, and I'll try to get you a picture of that on this video, but something that has an external mic to where you can use a lapel mic if you're wanting to upgrade in quality for your videos, but also going out and getting some studio lighting uh, that, that looks good that it won't have shadows, because I'm here on the wall, you can see shadows, but if I've got studio lighting on either side, that's gonna run about $200.
But again, it doesn't have to be perfect. It can be in your kitchen. It can be in your, your storefront. It can be at your desk. It can be on a black wall. Uh, if you've got one room that you want to tape off and create a black wall. But this whiteboard is great. For 20 bucks. you can go out to Home Depot, pick up some Rust-Oleum paint. But have fun with it. Ask some, you know, answer some questions that people ask about your product or service. And I think you're, I know that you'll have success. You want to figure out a way to link those back to get more views on your videos. And in the next, in this video series, we're going to be talking about, you know, how to generate more views on your YouTube videos, uh, get more traffic back to your site. So follow along with me at DeanEffers.com. Uh, enter your name and your email address in my opt-in form, and I'll send you all that information. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I've uh, got a little bit of touch-up to do where some of the paint has pulled off, but it's no big deal. Nice, clean lines over here that I can use for later. And make a pretty nice whiteboard for 20 bucks. So it works for me, and it'll work for you too. Have a great day, and we'll see you on the next video.